Hi, this is Karthik. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you multiplication of two numbers using Visual C++ 6.0 IDE. Once again, I repeat the topic: multiplication of two numbers using Visual C++ 6.0 IDE. In order to achieve this task, we should open Microsoft Visual C++. How to open Microsoft Visual C++? Quite simple. Go to Start and go to Microsoft Visual Studio 6.0 and navigate to Microsoft Visual C++ 6.0. Once again, I repeat the process. Go to Start where you can able to find Microsoft Visual Studio 6.0. Navigate to Microsoft Visual C++ 6.0. Just click it in order to open it. In order to use the C++ program, go to File, go to New, and go to Files where you can able to find C++ source file. Just click on it and provide a file name. Once again, I repeat the process. In order to use the C++ program, go to File, go to New, and click on Files. Where you can able to find C++ source file. Click C++ source file and provide the file name. Let's say multiply and click OK. When you click OK, you can able to see an area. This is called as workspace that we are going to key in our program. First, we will start with the preprocessor Ash. Include as a keyword followed by the header file iostream.h where stream.h the stream file and io stands for input output stream and followed by one more header file on io.h and followed by the name method i'm using integer name if you wish you can use void main too and followed by opening and closing curly brace and this is the area where we are going to type our code now I'm going to declare two data types integer a comma b to hold the values. So now I'm going to display information to the user enter a value and I'm going to get the value in C in C input stream and I'm going to store it in the variable A and I'm going for next line so C out end out it's the next line and going to display a message to the user enter B value so now I'm going to hold this value in B. Now I'm going to display the result C out. I'm going for next line. Let us say result. It's going to be A into A into B. I'm going to use get ch. What is the use of get ch? We can use the method get ch to wait. We can able to see the output screen until or unless the user key in the value. And in here you are using integer main. We should return an integer value. Return zero. So once again I repeat the program. So I'm going to declare two integer data type A and B to hold the values from users or user and I'm going to hold the A value and I'm going to hold the B value using C input stream and I'm going to multiply it A into B and I'm going to display the result to the user. After doing all the things, go to file and save this. And Go to build and compile it. 
where you can able to see zero errors and zero warning and go to build and execute the program so now it's asking for a value and b value and where you can able to see the result 200 so this is how you can do a code, a simple code in Microsoft Visual C++. I think you guys have enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.